So I'm here with Gal and Gabriel from MT Tech. Hi guys. Hi, great, great to have see you. you. See you again. So MT Tech stands for multi-touch technology, as I understand. Exactly. Tell us a bit about your wonderful products. Tell us about how you guys came together to collaborate on this project. Six years ago, Gabriel and I worked in a different company. Gabriel built a little model and he came to me and we both thought uh, how we can uh, sell this new surface, touch surfaces for new markets. We started uh, to explore every different technology for uh, smart uh, surfaces and for different markets as smart offices, smart restaurants. You can see our empty tech products on our smart uh, table office. Mm -hmm. Let's uh, for example see our key sense uh, system. So it plays video, I see, of course. Absolutely, it can um, display any um, kind of format uh, or file you have. And we can uh, edit, open a mirror wow. in front of you, so you can uh, see what the, the presenter is seeing. You can uh, change, mark wow. the, the text if you need so. Can I actually do that, or it's in editor control right now? Yeah, right? you have three ways. First of all is <laughs> transfer you the command. Wow, simple as that. So I press the blue button and then... Exactly. Wow. Yeah. That's incredible. You should see our smart conference room. It's very impressive as well. Actually, you can put inside integrated wow. CRM softwares, actually everything. We're bringing the future into the present. Right, absolutely. I mean, what, what types of customers have you got using it right now? For now, uh, real estate showrooms, mm -hmm. uh, car dealers, mm -hmm. um, inside offices, smart conference room. Mm -hmm. So you, you actually do custom make these uh, yeah. these products? Yeah, we can do any technology, any size, any design you have mm -hmm. with various of uh, solutions, software and hardware as well. So you actually install the whole application for them if they need some kind of specialist software for their business, then you will get it all ready for them and uh, uh, ready to go. Exactly, exactly. We are making our products highly functional mm -hmm. for our clients, yes. Fantastic. It's a wonderful entrepreneurial story already that you guys were working in a similar business. Uh, you innovated and identified a new product. Um, you then went in your own time with your own money and your own resources, you developed a product. And as I understand, you've been selling them all across Israel. Yeah, for right. the last five years. Um, and about two years ago, we find our, uh, our holy grail, as a, as a, as a matter of speak, mm -hmm. um, and we invented our ad hoc smart kitchen system that is a one part integrated from the countertop. It has many sensors, many functions. We went to a VCs in Israel, yet we uh, find it very hard to raise funds uh, in Israel for hardware. So we decide we will use our know-how to create these smart offices by selling them every time we can. We fund with that the development of our Kissen system. We see a lot of companies, uh, a lot of the time we talk about success stories where companies have raised money and so on, but people don't really understand how difficult that journey is to raise money, how difficult some of the venture capitalists are in their requirements, what they ask for from the company, yes. uh, the hoops that you have to jump through to, to, to get the money from them. So it's amazing that you guys have developed your own products yeah. without any funding in garage, the background. Garage, garage style, pure right. garage Fantastic. style. Fantastic. You then went out, uh, knocked on doors, sold products, uh, brought money in, and yeah. then you've been able to develop your even more innovative products exactly. and your next second stage products for the company through your own effort. A wonderful, wonderful story. Thank so you tell very us a much. little bit more. Right. The first generation of kisses was purely garage. Second was improved by it was patches, but still it was uh, high quality. The housing was from missile factory and the speakers in the microphone was from an ex-intelligence guy, yet it still was a patches. So about 10 months ago, we took a flight to Shenzhen and we uh, just moved from one factory to another, choosing the specific parts we want for the system. Today we have the third generation we start sales with, that is one perfect uh, system, yeah. This place able us to maybe continue our R&D efforts. So you guys are based in this fantastic space at yeah. Impact Labs, yes. um, who is part of the WeWork uh, group. This is a very specialist, um, I would say, incubator uh, shared workspace. 
because uh, you have all manner of tools. You have 10, 15 3D printers on the wall there, robotic arms and so on, things that, that enable you to uh, develop these products. It's like paradise for creators, you know, but yet we just uh, get in into these offices about a month ago. Here's our test version of our third generation uh, KeySense uh, system. First of all, it's Android. You can log on with your phone, you can connect to it, you can of interact course. with it. It has all the same music. functionality as, a, as an Android phone. Yes, right. let's say his mother, when she cooking, she always turn on the television in the living room to put music while she's cooking. I actually do that as well. So uh, yeah, yeah or, or the or the news, right? But you can actually have it in front of you. You can be cutting on the newscaster's exactly. head. Exactly. So it's synced with your smartphone. If someone calls you, you don't need to bother run over to your phone and stop your conduct in the kitchen. So there is the integral uh, weighing system, along with the interactive cooking guidance that guides you by the process how to cook. So I can actually put a bowl of sugar on here um, and it will tell me this is the weight of the bowl. Yeah. Um, I can put sugar inside and it will tell you here's 100 grams of sugar that you've weighed. Exactly, uh, it, it will pass by the uh, ingredients, tell you put sugar, stop, put flour, stop. So if you don't know how to uh, cook uh, some kind of recipe, it tells you, it guides you by the process. Right, right. And uh, along with that we have uh, the barcode sensor, you can see here that uh, when, in, when there is a missing item, it just ran out when you were cooking, you just can scan it and order it to the kitchen from the kitchen. And this is only the beginning. We have much more planned for sure. automatic refill uh, of the inventory. I mean, these are wonderful products and I, you know, I'm shocked to know that you started building these in your garage and actually making sales to real uh, businesses here. Yeah. And I think this is the real, uh, the real startup culture the real entrepreneurial spirit which, uh, which is inside of you and I think it's very, very important, very apparent. So what's the plan for that? We are looking to collaborate with kitchen uh, consumer electronic appliance, food companies. Well, uh, most of the harsh part is be behind both of us. We have our proof of concept, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Very much so and, uh, and, and as I said before, I think you've, uh, it's been an amazing journey um, it's certainly very close to my heart, um, I, you know, I was an entrepreneur who developed things in my bedroom with a laptop um, on my own, um, for long hours and yeah. hard nights and uh, not, lot, not a lot of money behind it um, and that's really the struggle and as I said before it's very admirable. Um, it's the struggle, but it's all, also the, the thing that puts you on, you know? It's also the fun bit of the company. Yeah, Sometimes the, 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 the exactly. most fun bit of the company is the startup yes. uh, stages, the development stages, because afterwards it's, uh, you don't get so hands-on, it's more meetings and yeah. conversations and so on. You need to live it, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm creating uh, innovation since I was 12 years old. Gabriel was hacking phones when he was in school like we are living in phenomenal stuff guy, thank guys thank you very much uh, thank you very much uh, i'd love to can't wait to see this one uh, actually in uh, in practice i know that you've got it in some uh, showrooms already here in israel some kitchen showrooms yeah um but i can't wait to actually see this in people's homes uh, around the world and we'll certainly be following your footsteps to see how you guys get on thank you. appreciate it thank All you right. very much thanks so much thank you for coming over john my pleasure we enjoyed as well <laughs>